look like a vampire. Mm. Hey guys, today I have another Amy Lee makeup look for you. I think this look was also requested by someone. I can't keep track of <laughs> who requests what and when, so they're all kind of just jumbled together in my brain and I can't remember, so I'm sorry if I forget who requests it, when it was requested, or even if it was requested, because there's just a lot. <laughs> there's a lot always going on in this brain. Anyhow, I have a picture of that look to show you now. Okay, so that is the picture for this look, or not for this look, for, you know what I mean. <laughs> If you want to see how to get this look done on yourself or just see how I did it and what I used, keep watching. For this tutorial, I used the Juvia's Place Deuce Palette, Maybelline H Rewind Concealer, Ico Lash Alert Mascara, and Wet n Wild Eyeliner Pencil in Black. B Hue Liquid Lipstick in 1548 and Wet n Wild Lip Liner in Willow. Here are the brushes I used listed out. Okay, let's get started. As always, we use our concealer first, applying it all over the eyelid, and then patting it down. Okay, now switching to the palette and the three brushes we're going to use. We're going to start with a blending brush and we're going into Berry Mousse. We're going to apply this shade all over the eyelid. Any beige type of shade that is a little bit darker than your skin tone will work for this. So we apply it and just smooth it out. Switching to another blending brush, and we're going into Chocolate, which is a matte dark brown, and we're starting by applying it on the outer corner, and then just blending it inwards and upwards. So the almost the whole eyelid will be covered with this color, but we want to make sure that we don't put too much at one time, and that we blend it out very well. So keep applying little by little to darken it and always starting on the outer corner. Continue doing this until it is as dark as we need it to be. Okay, now for we're taking the smudge brush back into chocolate and we're going to apply this color underneath the eye. Switching to eye pencil and we're going to darken the lash line by lifting the eyelid and getting right in between those eyelashes. We're also darkening the outer corner and a little bit on top of the eyelashes. Lining underneath and the waterline as well. Ok, 
Okay, now mascara time. Just coating the top lashes really well. Lip liner and lipstick or liquid lipstick. I don't have a red lip liner, so a skin tone actually works with a red li uh, lipstick. It helps to just line the lips and then you can cover it. Just line the lips, the liquid lipstick as usual. Any matte red that suits your skin tone will suffice. Making that disappear and the look is done. Okay, that's it for today's tutorial. I really hope you like that look. It's a bit vampire-ish, but I like it. <laughs> It's been a while since I've done anything like that, you know. Anyway, yeah, don't forget to give my video the thumbs up if you like the makeup. And if you like Amy Lee, I know I do. <laughs> Anyhow, yes, just lost my train of thought. Anyway, until next time, rock on. Be a blooper in your video. No. <laughs> Since I know some of you are gonna ask, <laughs> this hair, this is not mine, and uh, it's like my hair with a clip-in. So it's a clip-in, and I just twisted, teased up my hair, straightened this part, pinned it, and it hurts back here because I have like a clip and it's like digging into my scalp. <laughs> so yeah, if you guys request a hair tutorial for this, it's not happening because this is not my hair. I don't have enough hair to do such a huge, you know. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what that is. It's kind of, I don't even know what I was doing, honestly. I couldn't really see in the picture. It looks like she's got some kind of roll thing, but then something here and yeah. So tease it up, turn it, and pin it. <laughs> That's what I did. I added that the piece extra piece of hair thing and it worked out. I think we'll see in the pictures how it looks. But it was fun. I really like the brown eyeshadow like all over. I think that's really cool. That's pretty neat. Um, this is the last, not the last Amy Lee look because I'm going to keep uh, doing them. But for the month, you know how I did them all one, uh, one after the other. Uh, this is the last one. Starting next week, I will be doing one of mine. And then Amy Lee, one of mine, and Amy Lee. So for those of you who really enjoy my original makeup looks, next week, it's coming. Yeah. Anyhow, that's it. <laughs> Bye.